and Angelina Jolie may be glamorous A-list stars. They're also loving parents and selfless humanitarians, as we see in this brand new video of Angelina Jolie arriving in Haiti today. She's meeting with earthquake victims in her role as a UN Goodwill ambassador. But Showbiz Tonight can tell you, don't let Brangelina's nice side fool you. We're seeing today that if you push this humanitarian couple too far... Like their characters in Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Brangelina will kick butt and take names. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie are now suing the British tabloid News of the World for reporting that they are splitting up. The couple's London attorneys call the report, quote, false as well as intrusive. They seem to really be taking this News of the World story very seriously. Ever since they first got together in 2005, tabloids have been reporting in some way, shape, or form that Brangelina was either fighting, cheating, or splitting. How do you handle tabloids? I ignore them. In this 2006 interview on Larry King Live, Angelina said she and Brad don't pay attention to all the tabloid chatter. I've never been overly interested in those headlines, whether it was me or somebody else, but uh, I certainly make more of a point to ignore it now. They usually do not respond whenever questions come up about their relationship. They never say anything. But apparently, the recent report in News of the World was just too much for Angelina and Brad to ignore. It said the couple actually visited a Hollywood divorce lawyer last December to work out the distribution of their tens of millions of dollars in assets and to hash out custody of their six children. I think maybe one of the reasons they're going after this recent report was because this had a lot of specifics in it. And because it had specifics, people seemed to really believe it. The Brangelina breakup report spread like wildfire. And when they were suddenly missing in action at this year's early big award shows like the Golden Globes, that only fueled the rumor fires. The fact that they were not at any of these high-profile award shows together made people think, hmm, maybe this is true. Maybe they are actually breaking up. Now Brangelina are back out in full force. To show people that they really are together, they decided to show up to the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl that turned out to be the most watched television program in history. They're looking like they're in love. Everyone saw this. I would say this was as big news as the Saints winning the Super Bowl. This isn't the first time News of the World has been targeted by celebrities who feel the tabloid plays fast and loose with the truth. In 2006, David and Victoria Beckham also sued the paper for reporting they were about to break up. The suit was settled and, by the way, they're still together. And in 2005, Justin Timberlake sued the tabloid for falsely accusing him of cheating on his then-girlfriend, Cameron Diaz. He dropped the suit after the paper apologized and paid a settlement. But this time, it's clear news of the world has messed with the wrong couple. It seems like what they're doing with this British paper is that they're really trying to send a message. And that message is, if you come after Brangelina... Who's your daddy now? You'd better have your facts straight.